Uh, well, I actually started Cairo um, in kinder. Our year level was the first year level to go through the kinder at Cairo, I'm pretty sure. Um, my overall experience at Cairo um, has been great. Um, haven't really known um, much else, but I'm glad because Cairo has been um, a really good experience so far. What I've probably appreciated most is um, the Christian learning and Christian atmosphere um, at the school. Um, I appreciate that it's um, a school where teaching God is valued and um, that throughout um, all classes um, you are able to incorporate uh, Christianity without feeling judged about it. Well, 2020 has definitely been an interesting one, <laughs> um, but it, yeah, I've actually really enjoyed the online learning. Um, it's, well, it's something different, which is good. Um, I like to experience different things, and I have found that um, I've been able to be quite productive um, at home with my time. Oh, I'd have to, I'd have to say the camps, Kyra camps are the best. All of them have just been awesome from like year two, grade two sleepover, <laughs> that, that's killer, all the way up to the year 11 snow camp, which they just get better every year. Like Wilson's prom, I didn't think you could top that. And then went and glean um, to the Northern Territory in year 10. And I was like, nah, nothing can top that. And then there was snow camp, which is just, it was the best. Well, I pretty much like riding any board uh, that is known to man. <laughs> um, so lots of board sports. Um, also love, um, yeah, pretty much anything with a ball as well. Love kicking the footy. Um, also, in my spare time, um, help dad around on the, on the farm a fair bit and um, uh, fixing cars and stuff like that with him. Um, which I've been able to do a bit more with online learning as well. While doing school, I've been able to complete a certificate uh, three in sport and rec and a certificate three in fitness, which um, has set me up to be a personal trainer when I finish school. So working at um, a gym or in some uh, fitness prof profession is likely where I'll um, end up after school, which I'm quite pleased about. Well, if there's one thing that Health and Human has taught me, um, it's that water and sanitation is key in um, many countries um, and many um, low-income countries um, don't have access to safe water um, or clean water, which means that um, can spend women, especially women in those um, communities can spend hours each day just collecting water, um, which is an essential um, that people need. Um, so clean water and sanitation um, would just, yeah, would be really useful for those communities. So if um, I had a million dollars, I'd probably donate it towards um, making wells in those unreached community groups.